Hey, what's up guys? So you have a Samsung Tab A, SE5, or the uh, Tab 7. I'm going to show you how to screen mirror wirelessly to a TCL Roku TV. Now, really quickly, with this uh, screen mirror connection that's wireless, it is a Wi-Fi Direct using Miracast. It has nothing to do with your home Wi-Fi network, but you do have to turn on your Wi-Fi. Because again, it's going to use the uh, Wi-Fi direct connection. However, if you want to go ahead and mirror something that requires internet access, then obviously you need to be connected to your uh, Wi-Fi network or have a SIM card in your tab, okay? And it's going to relay onto the TV. So let me go ahead and show you how you connect. So first thing is go ahead and grab your tab. And what you want to do is swipe down the notifications. You want to swipe down like that. Then if you look over here, you see a little horizontal line right there. You want to go ahead and slide down again. And then from here, what you want to do is you want to look for Smart View. Samsung calls screen mirroring Smart View. So look for Smart View. It's not on this page. Swipe it over. Okay, maybe you have another page over. Okay, anyway, mine's on the first page right here. I can see Smart View. So let me go ahead and tap on that. Before I tap on that, you can see I'm not. my Wi-Fi is not even on. Okay, however, once I go ahead and do the... Um, um, smart view here is automatically going to turn on my Wi-Fi, but it's Wi-Fi direct, okay? So let me go ahead and tap on smart view here, okay? And now wait for it to find my TCL, Roku TV. There it is right here. Let me go ahead and tap on that. And then you get a message down here. It says start casting with smart view. Go ahead and tap on start now. And now you can see if I swipe down really quickly, you can see it turned my Wi-Fi on. However, I am not connected to no uh, home Wi-Fi network. It just says Wi-Fi. If I was connected to a Wi-Fi network, it would say the name of the network down here okay now as soon as you click on the smart view in a few seconds you should get a message something like this here it says my uh, galaxy tab s7 would like to cache your video to tv you can go ahead and put on always allow this way this message never pops up or just click on allow here and you'll always have this message pop up so here we go give it one second to connect here oops it just booted me off let me go ahead and do that again let's go to smart view I'll give it one second, which is something on the screen that's going to pop up here again. Oh, forgot to tap on uh, TCL Roku there, and then tap on um, Start Casting Smart View, tap on Start Now. And now, give it a second here, and we should see that message here pop up. There it is right there. I'm going to go ahead and click on Allow, and now it should work. Give it one second here. Oh, there we go. Okay, now you can see what's happening to the screen here. And anything I do on here is going to be relayed here. This is great for showing like work documents and stuff like that, uh, presentations. But most of you guys are probably going to be using this screen mirror if you want to show like your local um, videos and photos. So for example, let me go ahead and here's a photo here. You can see this photo here. And of course, you can zoom in and out. See right there. And I'll do a, uh, let's do a quick video here. So here's a quick test video. You press on testing play. one, two, three. Testing one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay, you got that. So from there now, I think you got the message. So if you want to go disconnect, you can just go ahead and swipe down notifications again. Swipe down again with a little horizontal line is swipe down. And then before it said smart view, now it says the name of the TV. Mine says a 32 inch TCL Roku TV. Just tap on that. And that's automatically going to go ahead and disconnect you. Okay? Pretty simple.